back to my youtube video i hope you guys are doing well if you're new here i'm lavarang and today i'm back with another vlog so this vlog is gonna be showing you guys my weekend in med school and how i try to balance the academics but also doing like things outside of academics like seeing friends and then specifically in this video i'll be going to a rugby match so it's officially varsity cup season and we're having our first home game on monday at 7 pm so i'm definitely going to that and also on that same monday at half past eight i'm writing my first test in second year it's an anatomy end of region test so basically it's an end of region test so basically we're doing um for the first part of this blog we're doing the upper limb so we're just gonna write on that region of the body the upper limb so that's what the test is gonna be about it also involves histology and also embryology so there's like a lot packed in 400 marks but then yeah that's um the work part and then the life part is like seeing friends going to a rugby game and all of those things so i'm just gonna show you guys my weekend and how things go and all of that but then yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video and yeah let's get right into it <music> the show and right now it's currently three minutes to 11 so what i'm gonna do currently is i'm just gonna go in there and wash my dishes so i can go and get lunch i was thinking of actually eating there because i literally never do that but then uh, i think i'm just gonna come back and eat in my room so yeah, um so today what i have planned is I actually wanted to go to rosebank but then i just scheduled it for tomorrow so it's fine i'll go tomorrow and then actually I have an ears tutorial at 12 today but i don't think i'm gonna go like nah i don't think i'm gonna go so yeah that's like all i had for today but then yeah since i don't i'm no longer going to eh i don't have that anymore so yeah um currently i'm just gonna go wash my dishes then go get lunch as i said and yeah then you can get started okay so i woke up today i woke up at seven then i just did some light studying i like um i chopped up my what's this i chopped up what's this anatomy morphology parts which is like cross anatomy all of those things i chopped like into different sections so i was able to do two of those sections and then after eating i'll be able to like consolidate them and just finish them off then after that i have to look at the like different compartment like the different parts of things so i'm just going to do that as well after that and then i can move on to just adding everything together because i did them like in section so after that i'm just gonna add everything together and then i can start doing embryology so embryology i did it before so right now it's just gonna be revision so i'm just gonna do embryology probably not gonna take long because it was not a lot of content so i'm just gonna do that just sort of memorizing so i'm just gonna do that and then end off with histology so hopefully by the end of today i'll be done with everything that i've just stated but if i'm not done it's fine and then um i don't know what time i'll sleep today but whenever i sleep and then i also wanna what's this i wanna do practice questions i think i'll leave i don't want to leave it until tomorrow to do practice questions because i feel like um in the past whenever i did that i never ended if i never like did all of them which is like at least i did some of them but then i wasn't satisfied with how many i did because i feel like practice questions are the best way to study for anything because as much as you know the content if you don't know how it's gonna be assessed you might miss maybe might undermine something in the content part but then actually find out that this thing is very right so like it's like that trick that they use so like doing past papers helps you to be aware of this kind of thing so i feel like yeah as much as i'm doing content i should also focus on um past papers because also if you're doing past papers then you realize that okay this concept i didn't actually understand that you're able to go back and build um add more to the knowledge of you had already so that also like reveals some like weak spots in your memory weak spots <clears throat> weak spots in your learning so yeah um right now i'm just gonna do as i said and yeah let's go hey guys so i thought i should update you guys so currently i'm doing i don't know if you can see this but i'm doing anatomy notes i'm just going through the notes 
so i'm just gonna finish this right now it's currently like a few minutes to two so i actually didn't eat my burger so i'm just gonna finish this and then eat my burger because i only ate the chips and i'm gonna eat my burger and then after that i'm gonna start um morphology <sighs> yeah god guys i'm feeling so lazy like today's just one of those days i know i'm writing on monday but then i can't take anything seriously like i seriously need to be done with the content today and i don't know because my discipline like i don't have discipline if i'm being honest like i really like discipline so i need to work on that maybe i should make a video on um starting like habits and then like sticking to them for a whole week because i don't know that how long does it take to build a habit like i don't know but i need some of that in my life like on a serious note and i don't have motivation right now so like so yeah ish. but then yeah i'm just gonna finish this i'm doing the um, arteries and veins then i'm gonna be done start embryology then come back to this later in the evening then histology i have a red bull in the fridge i think i'll drink that just for fun you know yeah because also drinking red bull kind of gives me the placebo effect that now i've got the energy that now i can do this so i think i need some of that in my system but yeah i almost fell asleep guys i almost fell asleep while on instagram reels because as you guys know i only download instagram on weekends so i'm like but then yeah let's let's finish it <laughs>
hey guys i am back from rosebank and i'm just gonna give you guys a haul of the things that i got so first bag it's from h&m and i'm just gonna show you guys the items that i bought so i just got um one pair of jeans they're this cream white pair of jeans they're um, 90s baggy jeans high waist by the divided brand and in a size six uk six so this is the jeans i don't i'm not gonna do a try and haul because you guys saw how these look in when i showed you guys when i was in h&m but like now i have blue jeans i have black jeans and now i have like cream white jeans so like i think i'm sorted for the whole winter basically but i do need to get sweatpants because last year i bought uh sweatpants from mr price and one thing about mr price is that they did not last like they are peeling and what's this now they're like, they're like short on me so i don't know if they shrunk or i grew taller but they don't look that great anymore so i need to get if i just get two pairs i think i'll be sorted for the whole winter plus i'll have these so i'll buy those like when it's like closer to winter basically and then the next shop that i went to okay let me show you guys what i got at mr price okay so at mr price i mainly went to get socks i like i couldn't find the gray like those ones that come with gray black and white pairs so I, um, I got these colors like they are okay i don't mind them i just wanted those like basic colors but uh, this was basically 100 rand and yeah like I, my socks i don't know where my socks went i literally only have like two pairs of like socks that match now everything else is mismatched and it's mismatched the point like i have white black gray i can't it, it, like it's mismatched and like right now i'm wearing two different like grays like and you can see one is from a surprise one is from puma like i don't have socks basically so i just got some socks and i usually get these ones but yeah the basic colors on it there but yeah these colors are fine and then i also got a trot lip because like the only one that i have is like green and like that is very limiting because i can't really wear it with like a lot of things how do you take this off so i just wanted a basic one like a black one and then as you guys i went to space stage and all of that so I got these ones like they kept falling off i have to like do this every time when i was doing something so I finally got them adjusted and they like they don't fall anymore and then i also got like, let me show you guys the other pair okay so these are the other pair and basically i just got them like the screw on one of the i don't know like one of the screws here had come off so like i got it replaced and they did everything for free which i'm so happy about so like but then yeah these are the other frames like I'm sure it's been a while since you guys saw these ones so i think i'm gonna go back to these ones because i think i like this frame more what do you think which frame is better this one i think i've grown to this one or this one no i think i've grown to this one but then yeah, that's all that i did it's big steps but the other was saying placed an online order for cotton on and it finally came okay so this is the first you this looks small i got extra small so you should, we'll see how it looks and i don't know why i got <laughs> i'm not a person who wears crop tops so like this is definitely out of character but then but i also don't have a long torso so it's probably not gonna look like a but then like it's like a halter neck and then it goes like yeah i don't have a long torso so maybe this could work let's see if it okay perfect 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 okay this is the first one okay and actually the reason i bought these because they were on sale they were like 100 rand each and then the second one is just a basic white shirt oh i like this so much it's just a basic white crop top because i feel like i also have like dresses that i like need just like a white top underneath so yeah i didn't have that so i just wanted to get this one and it's like actually t-shirt material which i like as well i also got an extra small in this and then i expect this make sure but it's basically a long sleeve t-shirt for the winter i literally got this because it was like first of all it's cotton on so it's good quality and then it was on sale so i wanted to get it cheap so that you this was from 230 to 100 rand nah i kind of still here because like, i was like can you guys see this and now body 400 trend that's crazy but yeah i have like white i have gray and also have like this kind of like teal color of long sleeves i just wanted a black one it's stretchy yeah it's just gonna wear under 
my clothes during winter so i don't i'll try that on later but i don't know if i'll show you in the fall okay so i went to check out and the first thing that i got i got uh, yeah, a bottle of oreos so i actually wanted to get cranberry juice or like a two liter of coke but then i realized that like if i get either of those two it's gonna be done within a week and i can't be like it is just cheaper for me to get a, to get this ones and keep on making my own juice and having to buy like a bottle of coke a week just to have something to drink so i made that decision and then i also got um plain yogurt just to have that as a snake inside my room because like most of the night most of the nights i'm always so angry because like we have dinner from like five to seven and like when it like hits around for nine around 11 around 12 like i'm around like 10 i'm always so angry so i got that and i'm just gonna here it is you guys know this combo this combo is the best like it tastes so amazing so i got that and then i also got some plums because i found myself like craving plums actually like, craving any type of fruit but i didn't have anything so i got uh, plums and then also got this i got just like a black binder because I have a white one currently and it's like it's filled up and it's like literally only the fifth week of second year so just wanted to get another one this was like 20 something rand and i didn't feel like going to um what's this pna so i just got it at checkers and then the last thing that i got which is probably my favorite is the dong like I love the tongue so much, especially the beef one. I just like the basic beef one. I love normally I get the pig and pea one, but I've actually never tried the chickens one. So that's both tongue is nice. Like, you have to see the goodness yeah. mm So I've been doing past papers right now like as you guys see in the time lapses but I'm just doing them on my laptop over here so it's currently like I don't know I don't know the time I think it's I'm filming on my phone okay it's got up past two and I'm just gonna do this until four o'clock in the late four o'clock I'm just gonna get dressed and get oh I need to print some stuff for church so need to make time for that yeah but then I'll, yeah i'll figure that out and then i'm just gonna get dressed and get ready for church so um i've been doing some past papers and yeah past papers as i said really help to like understand to remember as well because maybe there's some things you might be undermining but um, yeah yeah i just wanted to tell you guys the story of the starbucks drink that i uh, ordered today so i got a caramel frappuccino ne? and it was so sweet it was giving can i give you some coffee with your caramel that's how sweet it was like it was literally caramel everywhere so definitely not gonna order that again but i'm pretty sure that's what i ordered last time just that this time around they didn't ask me what kind of chips i want last time they asked me and then i wanted java chips but then this time around but i'm pretty sure i ordered the same thing i don't know if they changed the menu or what but whatever it is they really killed me because 
nah i kind of wasted my money because that was not nice like at all and one thing about me is that guys i'm not a sweet tooth so like those sweet things nah man they're not my thing so i'm trying to go back to my last video to see what You're i ordered to see what i ordered exactly so i know if maybe i'm the one that made the mistake or they changed the menu but looking at um the thumbnail of the video it looks like they're two different drinks but then i'm pretty sure hey that's why having youtube videos is so helpful because now i can look back and see what i ordered why is there no sound to this amazing back from rose bank and first thing that i got i just want to show you guys i got a caramel frappuccino with i even forgot about it i forgot but then yeah it's in a tall and then yeah i just passed them to write 1k subscribers it was kind of embarrassing like them calling it out but then yeah i don't know what i was going on with that but let me stop talking and procrastinating and go back to the past papers what i do with past papers i just go through the question and i also um get the answers as well to see what well, if i'm doing things correctly or not and then i also just go like i'm in cinematic mode so you might not show this but i also just go through notes to fill in the gaps wherever they are but then yeah let's go back into study region test as i said so right now it's currently 20 minutes to 8 sorry and we have to be there at 8 o'clock so i'm just gonna pack myself right now and go there and also need to take my padlock so i can lock my locker um so they finally are located one to me so i'm just gonna do all of that and then leave right now um i'm feeling okay about the test i feel like i've done as much as i could so knowing that i did as much as i could it's it's a calming feeling obviously you always think that you would have you could have done more but then i'm satisfied with the amount that i've done and yeah so then i'm just gonna pack my things put on my shoes and then head out hey guys i am back from the test and i don't know but i think it went really well like i remembered a lot of stuff there's nothing that i was like i forgot per se but there are some things that i was hearing for the first time it's just one question where like i completely guessed but then i was able to get the two out of the i was able to get two correct out of five yeah by just guessing so yeah and there isn't i know that i got it right because i searched it up after the test but then yeah yeah i'm so happy i'm done and next thing so right now what i'm gonna do is currently um it's currently um 25 minutes to 11 so i'm just gonna clean my room i didn't get a chance to do it on the weekend because i was um because i was busy with anatomy and I, oh guys let me tell you a story i forgot to submit my SEMD quiz like the one that was two yesterday night like i forgot 
I forgot. So I have to email the lecturer and ask him for an extension. I don't know if he's gonna allow me to or what. But I'm just gonna try my luck. Like this has never happened to me before. And I literally realized it when I when I when I was at what? I realized it like immediately when I was about to like before I left this, before I got before I went to medical school to write the exam, I realized I had I hadn't submitted that quiz. Like yo it's like the nervousness of for the test and also like knowing that I did not submit a quiz like that kind of like yo I was like I was shaking. I don't know how to explain but then like it made me more nervous. Like just the thought of like I didn't submit a quiz, I missed a deadline, like that thought and also going to write a test here was not a good feeling but I was also I didn't I have my lab coat I literally didn't wash my lab coat from last week I would just put it in the laundry basket because I was just so busy because I never do my laundry on Sundays but I actually didn't do it last yesterday because I was just so busy with anatomy as I said because I didn't think we would need a lab coat today but fortunately I had a friend who could why is this why does this thing keep going down but fortunately I have a friend who borrowed me hers so I was able to write the test and stuff. So I'm just gonna clean my room right now, like sweep the floors, just pack my anatomy things and put them away. Cause I'm no longer doing the upper limb. We're starting with the thorax. Is it the thorax? I'm not sure. I'm not sure, don't quote me on that. But we're no longer doing the upper limbs. I'm just gonna pack my boots. I don't wanna see them anymore until the block test. So I'm just gonna pack them away, clear my desk, clean my room. And then I think I'm also gonna put my clothes in the laundry right now. So let's go do that. Welcome to Lebo Hang's channel. <laughs> Don't forget to like this video and subscribe. Hi, exactly. <laughs>
Alright, so the match is over and we won 34 17. See how we won on home ground. We had to, we just had to. So the game didn't start off great because we were losing in the first half, but then the second half we actually won. But I'm with Hope. Hi guys! So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I'll see you guys in the next one. Yeah, like, comment, share, and subscribe.